So today I'm going to give an informative speech over unnecessary classes in college. Alright. We'll start with uh, each degree is forced to take way many unnecessary classes uh, that did not retain to their actual major. And uh, today most of my uh, examples are going to be over the psychology degree at the University of Memphis. And uh, each degree for a bachelor's it requires about 120 credits while about only 40 credit hours are actually rooted towards your major. And uh, so if only 40 credit hours are towards your major, then you're only spending a third of your time in college actually learning about where you're going to college to learn. So why, what other classes could we be taking that are so important to you getting a degree in whatever career path you're choosing? All right, so why must we take so many basic classes over and over? All right, so as it states here, the University of Memphis requires one of three different English classes, two history classes, three different science classes, and two foreign languages. So here we are, with, we have to take three different English classes, two history classes, three science classes, and two foreign languages to learn psychology. All right, so like in school, for example, you learn English every year, all year, all the way until you graduate from high school. And uh, so why, when we get to college, after 12 years of English, are we still taking three more English classes? I, the only example you, I feel that would be necessary for so many English classes would be perhaps if you're going to be a teacher of some sort, whether elementary, high school, or college, I could see, but such as college, or such as uh, psychology, you're going to college for psychology, I don't see why it's necessary to take three English classes. But. <clears throat> And also you take 12 electives. Now I feel like electives can be important because, you know, perhaps you find a, uh, you know, going to school for psychology, for example, you take some electives and learn that maybe you like sociology more and that's more of your passion than perhaps psychology was. I feel like it's a good way to find different passions and maybe your proper career that you would actually enjoy, uh, but I don't think we need 12 electives. I mean, that's 36 credit hours, and your major is 40 credit hours, so you're taking almost just as many classes that retained absolutely nothing about your degree as you are the foundation of your degree. According to the Washington Post, Colleges have added too many unnecessary degree requirements and remedial courses that keep students in school for much longer than needed. A standard bachelor's degree normally takes four years, yet in recent years it is more common to finish around six years and often longer. And this is due to, as they have stated, degree requirements and re remedial courses such as, as we stated, so many electives and Englishes, maths that pertain nothing to do with what your plans in the future and your career are toward. To me, it would make more sense if we focus more on core classes retaining to the major. And also, we could create, with that, we could create greater focus on the major <clears throat> all of these classes are net, take only the necessary classes that pertain to your major. And uh, let's carry on with the consequences if these did change. All right, it, uh, the time it takes to earn your degree could significantly be reduced to at least the normal four years. 
the amount of money spent on college also could be greatly reduced. <clears throat> One's knowledge on their selected major could also uh, skyrocket. One major graduate <clears throat> one may graduate with a bachelor's degree knowing just as much about their major as someone who had previously had a master's degree because you could focus much more on the focus of your major instead of taking so many irrelevant courses towards your major, such as the English and so on. In conclusion, we should spend less time on classes that have no effect or regard towards one's major. Also, this will save money and time the students have to spend towards college. Because we all know college loans are no fun. <clears throat> you could also be better, better prepared for your career this way because you could learn so much more about the subject if you had more focus on the subject rather than these basic courses that you are now required to take. And likewise, the graduation rate would dramatically escalate as students would be more interested in their studies. After all, they went to college to learn about the specific subject in which they go to major in. So why are we forcing everyone to take these unnecessary classes? Thank you. <sighs>